channel. This is going to be another hair update. Um, okay, let's get into it. I cut my hair, I believe it was October 28th or something like that, a couple days before Halloween. And um, as you guys can see, I am growing. We are growing. We are definitely growing back here because um, if you watch the, my new haircut, the video, this was like half of this length. So I think I've um, gotten maybe an inch, inch and a half some places. The back, this area here, I had actually still been um, shaping it up and cutting it, you know, with the clippers just because it, it sticks out a little bit like this and I didn't like it so I would cut it with the clippers. But I am trying to grow my hair so I had to stop cutting it with the clippers. Actually, you could look right here and see how much it actually comes over my ear. Okay, when you get your hair cut in a, a short cut, they always cut it around your ear. So this, all this is new length. You see how long that is now? Yeah, it's growing pretty nice. I, I like it. I'm, I'm enjoying this phase right here where it's a little bit longer. I can just toss some curls on the top and the sides and go with it. It takes me literally like maybe 10, 15 minutes to do my hair. Okay, now I do want to talk really briefly about some product switches that I've made because um, the other products just weren't getting the job done well enough for me anymore. And um, you guys know I was raving about the smooth and hold pudding. And if you watch my first video on how I did my hair, I used this on the sides and the back. When it was shorter, it worked. But now that it's a little bit longer and I can actually even curl all the way back here, this is just too oily. It's not, it doesn't, it's not doing what it's supposed to do anymore. So I don't really use it like that anymore. It smells good, but I did start to notice that after I would put it on, sit under the dryer, it would smell like a relaxer. And I actually had a guy ask me, did you just perm your hair today? And I was like, no, I didn't. But this product starts to smell like relaxer. So that's just a little update on the smooth and hold pudding. Somebody had actually asked me if it got too greasy, and it does. So if your hair is a shorter length, you could still use it to mold it. But what you want to do is use less of it. Okay, like so when I molded my hair, I still used a teeny, teeny bit just back here on the nape because it is very moisturized and that's hence it's oily you understand so it, it I did use a tiny bit here and I have been using the Afuji style and wrap mousse um I've always used the style and wrap mousse anytime I needed to mold my hair using a mousse so I'm, I don't think anything's really wrong with it but it, it's not moisturizing and I've been experiencing really dry crispity crunchity hair okay because um, having to mold your hair sit under the dryer curl it with the flat iron curl it with the curl iron even using a heat protectant that's a lot of heat it's gonna dry your hair that's why I was wearing half wigs for a while a couple weeks just you know letting my hair breathe and everything like that and now I'm back styling my hair again so I was at the hair store and I picked up this a lot of body olive oil foam wrap okay it is a regular hold the hold is pretty much the same as this one um but it it it's a little bit moisturizing for me i liked the fact that it gave me a little bit of moisturizer okay um yeah i think the olive oil in this is great so what I did with this was the same thing like I did in my video I in my hand and I actually molded everything down with it including the sides everything and then like I said I put a little bit of pudding just a teeny bit on the nape so I used this all over my head and I actually had a fresh perm I just permed my hair yesterday 
so um yeah short hair looks good with a fresh perm i'm telling you you can do anything you want spike it up or whatever but if it's, when it's freshly permed it's gonna look beautiful okay and um this gave me a really good hold with the fresh perm I mean, a really good mold with the fresh perm and hold, whatever you want to say. So, this is going to be my new um, um, mousse that I'm going to use to mold my hair down. This is, was actually $7.699, and this is only $4.99. Yeah, it's a smaller bottle, but I think it's the same amount. Or no, I'm definitely wrong. This is one ounce less, but whatever. I like this product better, so this is going to be my new, um, my new foam mousse for molding my hair. So I'm no longer going to be using the Afuji and the pudding. And if something happens with this and it turns out I don't like it, I'll definitely let you guys know. But so far, so good. I'm loving it. All right. Lee, that is the it for my update um if you guys want to know how i style my hair i do have a video for that if you guys are interested in my makeup i do have a video for that if you're interested in what i'm wearing the outfit of the day video will be coming up next so thank you guys so much for watching love you lots stay tuned for more of my great videos bye